Let's now insert a couple of shapes on the screen, on the slide. We're going to create a paw, an oval around the paw, as well as a call out. So click on Insert, Shapes, and select Oval, and put a small oval just around the paw. Okay. Then click Insert the insert tab and shapes again and select call out there are many types of call outs there and I'll click that one and you can click the diamond triangle and move it closer to the cat okay now inside the bubble we will go ahead and type the word meow we can make the font bigger so that it's easy to see. Let's go ahead and make it 28 or 32. We can make the call out bigger. Now close the clip art box and we'll add some animations. Click the meow bubble, go to animations and select add animations. Choose appear under the entrance options okay. and on the animation pane click animation pane you'll see it there call out for meow hover over it double click it and under timing click on the arrows next to triggers and let's make this start effect on click of oval 3 okay then click OK. Now go ahead and do Shift F5 to see how it works. If you click on the oval, the meow appears. Let's go ahead and click on the home button and it'll take us to the 200. So click on, um, we'll need to add a hyperlink to animation for 200. So let's go ahead and do that. Select the 200, right click, hyperlink, and it's within the document and we want animation for 200. Click OK. So now that's all set. You can go ahead and test it out quickly. Shift F5. If you click on animation for 200, you get the cat. Escape to get out of that. Let's go ahead and add another animation for the cat. So click the meow bubble and add animation. And this time what we want is under emphasis, let's select wave. Okay, so click wave. It'll do that. And we want the wave to appear after the meow appears. So click on the wave and drag it down so that it's number two. So the first animation is the meow appearing, the second animation is the meow waving. So this is a timeline showing what will happen with the animations. Double click on the wave and go to timing and again you'll see that the effect is, effect is uh, due to oval 3. Click OK and let's go ahead and test it out. So the first time you click on the oval, the meow appears, the second time it waves. So press escape. Now we want to add sound. So let's go ahead and click on insert. Audio. Click on the arrow. Clip art audio. Select that. And search for cat. Press go. And you'll get the cute fake cat. Select that and it'll appear on your slide. If you press play, you can hear a cute fake cat sound. Double click the sound file under the animation pane. You'll see it right there, the third item. Double click the cat sound in the animation pane and go to timing and under triggers make sure the start effect on click of the meow, the call out for the meow. Then click OK. 
Now if you do Shift 5, if you click on the oval it appears, if you click it again it waves, and if you click on the call out for the meow, you will hear the cat sound. Now we don't want the um, icon for the audio to be on the screen like that, so you can move it off the screen. You can minimize by clicking the plus minus signs there and then move it off the screen. So you have that. And let's do one last thing. Let's make the paw, the oval around the paw, transparent. So go to right click on it and go to format shapes. For the fill color, make it transparent, so 100%. Transparency is 100%. For the line color, make the transparency also 100%. Or you can select no line. So that's how it'll look like. Now let's click Shift F5. And you click on the paw, the meow appears. You click again, it moves. If you click on the meow, it'll make a sound. And that's it for the animation activity.